It was about 1991 or 1992. It's quite a long time ago now, so I can't really remember exactly. I'd just come out of the military and it was difficult. I was struggling a little bit getting used to civilian life because I'd been in the military for quite a while. So I used to like to go hiking and climbing sort of to get away from everybody and I'm from uh, Manchester from Great uh, North North Manchester and I used to go to a place called Duff Souls Reservoir which is up near Oldham which probably doesn't mean anything to anybody but um, it's a beautiful place they have three reservoirs going up um, in like a step in like steps different levels so I got there this morning about five o'clock, it was in the summer. So it was just getting light. And I started off with the dogs, walked past the first reservoir, walked past the second reservoir, I was walking past the second reservoir, and something didn't feel right. It was a weird feeling. The only way I can describe it the sort of feeling you have when you forgot to do something, something sort of niggling at the back of your mind. But anyway, I tried to think of what it could be and I couldn't think of anything. So I came up to the third reservoir, the last one, and they had built a new dry stone wall all the way around. So I decided to stop there for five minutes and have a drink. So I climbed up on the wall with the dog. The dogs climbed up as well. And we were just looking at the reservoir. And got myself, got my flask out and I was having a drink of coffee. And on the far, you've got to bear in mind these reservoirs were big. On the far side of the reservoir, it just didn't look right. It was almost like when it's really, really when it's a really, really hot day, and you can see the road, and the heat is making the road look wavy on the horizon. That's what it looked like, the water on the far side of the reservoir. But obviously it couldn't be that because it was five, just like half past five, six o'clock in the morning and it, was, it wasn't that hot. <laughs> so we were sat there looking and this, met, this didn't come back to me straight away. I sort of forgot this for a long time what had happened and what I'd seen. It was only sort of recently that by piecing memories together, I actually remembered what, what I'd seen. There was something on top of the water, something quite big, probably the size of two double-decker buses if you turn them on the side and put them together. That's the sort of size I think it was. But I couldn't... It was like the water on the surface of the reservoir was going up in a shape, in a weird sort of... just like a teardrop shape. And... I stood up on top of the wall and I couldn't actually, I thought I was having an hallucination at first, I couldn't believe what I was seeing and there were some small figures by, this, by the bank and it was right up against the, the far bank of the reservoir. My dogs were acting really, really strange. Um, I had Staffordshire Bull Terriers, which 
they don't really get scared of anything and they're that's really really strange so I was gonna go over and have a look but something inside told me just sort of stay away I was better not to go over so I just sat down and I was watching and I think it was about 15 or 20 minutes this object these little figures went into the object no that's wrong they went round the what I perceived to be the back of the object and I didn't see them again so I presumed that they went into the object and then a few minutes later the object just shot straight up in a in a line straight straight up really 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 quickly and when it got to probably 1000 1500 feet it stopped and then just zoomed off and I just could not could not comprehend what I'd just seen it was so bizarre like I said earlier I don't know if I'd forgot what had happened or it was just something that because it was so strange and so bizarre, sorry to use that word again, that my mind sort of filed it away somewhere and it was only over the last few years that I've actually remembered. And the way I remembered it, there was something on the TV about Dove Stones, something completely different, nothing, just something to do with the National Trust. And all these memories started flooding back and to this day I can't believe what I saw and it's crazy all I can say is it's crazy that I've been I was there at the right time I was in the right place at the right time and I just can't I can't believe what I saw but I think I've seen it since as well but not at the same place. And from what I have researched and what I have learned, I think if you see something like that once, that maybe you have seen it before, that time that you saw it, and you will see it after. I don't know. But that's just my own theory. I hope you enjoyed the story. It's, just, it's true as far as I can remember. Thank you.